against AIDS and COVID-19 playing out here at the Bohegan Park, both hitting this Bronx community hard. The first line of defense providing free testing. Presenting World AIDS Day. It's a free community event. Right next to NYCHA's forest and the Kenley houses in the Bronx on this playground. If you come inside the park, come with a mask. It was a socially distanced block party of sorts with the DJ and dancing, but with an important message. So you have NYC laboratories that's doing free COVID-19 testing and has been since the pandemic. You also have the Alliance for Positive Change that's also doing uh, not just COVID testing, but HIV testing for free. The event organized by Bronx Council member Vanessa Gibson. According to the New York City Department of Health in 2019, 26% of new HIV infections were in the Bronx. And when it comes to COVID-19, the Bronx is the borough with the second highest rate of infections in the city. With 4,356 cases per 100,000 people compared to a citywide rate of 3,507 per 100,000 people. This is the epidemic that we faced first in our lifetimes, okay, as a community. And now this is the second one. We are here to provide free HIV testing and hep C. It's only uh, about 30 minutes it will take. Two underlying reasons that we continue to struggle with. It's our poor healthcare infrastructure system in the Bronx, and it's also uh, food insecurity. Isabel Medina and Stephen Bathia came out to take advantage of the free testing. It's good for the community. They care about the community, and they want, they want everybody to be aware that it's going on. Hello? So I brought my daughter here. Can I get it tested too? These community groups say lessons of four decades fighting AIDS are now vital in the battle against COVID-19. The high level of infection rates in the black and brown communities, African-American, Latino, Latinx communities, and we have to do more to raise a level of awareness, not just on World AIDS Day. And if you want information about free testing in your community for HIV or COVID-19, just go to my Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter page at Monica Morales TV. We'll link you to those resources. In the Bronx, Monica Morales, PIX11 News.